Well, good new touch. See, I'm trying to do neutral. Ah, uh, I hear myself. Give me a second. Hold it, hold it. Where? Where? Off? No. <laughs> I was gonna start saying stuff, and then I heard myself. I was like, no, turn myself off. Uh, good new time zone and reality, everyone. How are you all doing? My name is Vel here at Science Way, and welcome back. And um, I mean, way back. It's been a while since I streamed. Things are different. For example, my layout's kind of different. My webcam position's a little different. That's because it's higher up. Um, yeah, so today, well, first of all, I've been wanting to stream for ages, like a long time. I haven't because I was really busy with school. I had a family visit. I had a birthday. Woo! So I haven't had time to stream. But today I was like, today is the day I'm going to stream. I was going to stream earlier, but then I was like, hmm, you know, I haven't, I haven't streamed in a long time. All of my links and stuff, not all of them, but I mean, a lot of links in the descriptions across three platforms in my description were outdated. So I was, I spent like a couple hours updating that stuff. So, I mean, I didn't say I was going live today. It's like a surprise stream, but yeah. And what we're going to be doing today is if you couldn't tell by, oh no, I didn't put it in the um, title. I just said we're updating Science Away Art. We are doing that first and foremost though. We are going to be updating my business card. I've never designed my old business card on live, uh, on live stream, but it's outdated. And I just said, I'm changing my brand colors. I'm going from the purple, pink, and turquoise to Cool Colors Galaxy. And Cool Colors are green, blue, and purple. And plus it's Galaxy, so I'm not going from flat colors, I'm going to a Galaxy theme. Everything else stays the same, the name's still the same. Uh, I updated my logo a little bit more than my previous one. I will pull up my, my old business card if I have it. Um, but yeah, how are you all doing though? Hope you're having a good day. If not, it will get better. And every day I was looking to stream making my business card. My mom was like, hey, I need you to really work on your business card. I was like, well, I want to stream its art. I can do the best of both worlds. Let's let's do that. So, <laughs> yay. All right, so I had to get used to this layout of GIMP because I'm on my new equipment and it's bigger. I'm not used to that because Gimp on my other other computer, it had like this side was an individual window, so it was this side. This set is now like a its own window, and they're kind of small. I need to, I should make that bigger. Anywho, so this is my current work in progress. Uh, let me see if I can open up my old business card. Do I even have it? See, I probably have the image of it, which is more likely the case. No. See, did I name it business card though? I'm pretty sure I didn't. I just want to show it just so you all can see what it used to look like. And I know I have it. It's not that. It's not that. Because I've seen it in here. Oh, is it this? No, it's not that. Where is it? Yeah, I'm, I'm up to date because I had some, like, for example, my YouTube link was Virtual Veil Science. I've changed it since then. I'm no longer Virtual Veil. I'm Science Your Way. So that, of course, was outdated. I had a, my Zazzle store on there, which I don't even update anymore since I'm on Amazon now. So that, I had to remove that. And let's see. Oh, it's called Banner 1. Why would I do that? Makes no sense. So I don't think I have the original file, but here was my original business card. And I don't know where my back is. I did have a back, but it wasn't that great. And of course I copied my brother's design. He did the same thing, except, no wait. That's not the final business card. That's the one I designed. Oh no, that's the banner. That's not even the business card. Right, that was for when my dad had to print the banner for an event. The business card was like this though. Of course, you know, that's a Google image and 
I don't even want to talk about this one and yeah it was good for at the time but never again and of course these are my old colors which is this pink and turquoise and purple I blanked out sorry so we're changing that because now it's going to be this lovely space galaxy colors and if you couldn't tell I really love galaxy stuff I never I've never I was never huge into space but I love galaxy stuff it's kind of weird but oh well so we're gonna be updating that and let me show you what the work in progress looks like so I have all these layers I have so many layers it's not funny it's kind of funny so this is the front of the business card and I basically worked a lot of, I worked on this a lot off camera and I was working on it I actually was and I got distracted because again family visit school birthday it threw my whole like work schedule off course um, so yeah, this is the front of the card these are my you could say titles best-selling author steam nerd and that's science technology engineering art and math I have instructor I published just that online instructor well instructor's fine and I have YouTuber and I probably want, I might want to say content creator I don't know it, it's fine most people will understand when you say YouTuber content creator can be like oh what kind of content do you do I stream I record I it all depends now the back of the card so and I've already, what I've done here is the back of the card is just gonna be all links we're not really gonna be editing the back of the card too much but the thing was, let's see, so I changed the merch link, I removed my Udemy course link, and I decided, I got these, okay, so I got a lot of these icons except for, no, I got that one. I got all of these icons off of the website Flat Icon. I had a membership for a while and I had downloaded all, like a bunch of assets. So what I decided to do was I really like shapes. My favorite shapes are ones that have edges. So basically everything that's not round. Round shapes are okay. I do like a few round shapes, but I'm more into shapes. My favorite shape is a hexagon. I don't know why, I just love hexagons a lot. And I really want hexagons on my business card to kind of show, well, my personality and give the card personality. So what I did was I turned the hexagon, because you know, there's hexagons that's more like, do I have one? I, I do somewhere. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Some hexagons are, well, a lot of hexagons are usually like this, which is my favorite style, but I also do like it when it's like this. Also, if you see all these lines, these are my guides. I can't move the guides. I can make them not visible. Let's do that so you all can see them easier. Show, okay. there we go. So this is what I have. I did, I do like it like this, but I like it the other way too. It's still a hexagon because it has the same amount of faces. And what I decided was I need to make it techier. Well, techier. And what I decided was, oh, you know what? I can, I have them somewhere. It's really small, but it has to be. I thought I had a big version. There we go. So what I did was I took these pieces of, it's also from, these, all the stuff is from Flat, flat Icon. And, um, I took a like a circuit board or something that was in a pack I had downloaded and I erased bits of it and there's still like a bit visible that looks like it is I have to go look at the other ones now and see if they have that uh, but hey I caught it now so woo. <laughs> but let's undo that and where is the eraser here here we go there we go much better all right anyway Let's do that, yep. So what I did was I just decided, oh, you know what? I can add these little things to the side, which makes it, which has like a cool effect, I feel. And I couldn't decide to either use this tech piece or that tech piece. And you know, this one was almost like colons, just techier. This was, not that, this was more like an arrow I felt. And I was like, well, they both work. So what I did was, let's do this, I would use both of them. So on the back side of the card you have these, you have the pointing ones because it's like it's pointing to the link. And then I have these right here because it's almost like a colon on the bottom for the, 
you know, for the titles. So that's what I have so far. That's pretty much it. I made the logo and let me show you the old logo here. This was my YouTube banner, which I will be updating. Hopefully if we have enough time, I'll be updating a lot of my art on stream. Cause like I said, I fixed my, um, I fixed my descriptions on all three platforms, you know, pick Arto, YouTube, and um, Mixer. Sorry, it's been a while since I've streamed and talked out loud. But yeah, I've updated all the descriptions for that and all the information, and I couldn't update the art because I don't have any updated art. So of course, the first thing first is the business card. You think it's other stuff, but it's really important to get the business card done. So this is like the old banner, and this is my old logo right here. I just had, you know, these colors. I had a game controller, a little art thing, and the science symbol. Basically to say that, hey, these are the three main things I do. And if you look closely, all the science things are green. And the icon here is green. See, a lot of science stuff, they're in green. All the art stuff is pink. It's in the pink hexagons. See, I told you I love hexagons. So I have all these hexagons here, you know, all the art stuff, and then all the game stuff. So you have know, robots, engineering, puzzles. Of course, a lot of this does look like science anyway, because science is a lot of things. But yeah, so I did that, and I was like, well, first of all, I'm not that big. I'm not a big fan of pink anymore. I do like that shade, but compared to other stuff, no, I'm not a fan of pink. Plus, because of what my brand is, I'm thinking, no, I don't really want pink in my brand brand color. Uh, I can explain that later if anyone wants that. But I was like, yeah, let's just, I just need to change this. So I did struggle. I was like, what three colors? I need three colors. And eventually I was like, oh, I could branch out. I could do five or four colors. And I struggled because I couldn't find any colors that worked well together. See, these three colors work together because they're kind of, they're kind of girly. Yes, they're they're kind of girly, kind of not girly, but they just work together, you know? I was trying to find colors that didn't make it seem girly. It does say Science Away, but Science Away is a brand that's all about doing science stuff, not girly. No glitter, no bling, no jewelry. Well, not no jewelry, but I mean like no bling, like I said, no glitter. And when I had these colors, in remember, I created Science Away last, no, two years ago. Two years, wow, it's been two years. Two years ago. And so when I was into these colors. At the time, I was just like, oh, I'm just into these colors. And now I'm just like, mm, Science Away is, like my brother told me, Science Away is bigger. I need to not have these colors. Anyway. And he didn't say that, but I'm just like, I don't want these colors. And there's nothing wrong if you are into science and you're a girl and you do like pink or these girly colors, There's nothing wrong with that. I just don't want to, not necessarily promote, but have that in my brand colors. Since if you go to the stores, there's already enough of this out there. That's why I have Science Way to do the opposite because I can't find anything. For example, this right here, it's my favorite. It has no glitter, it has no bling, and you will not find it inside the stores anywhere. It was online on Amazon. That's exactly why. If I had to, when I go clothes shopping, I, it's very hard for me to close shop because I can't find anything I actually like that's not curly, not bluey. Most of my clothes, if I do find something, it's from the boys section because they have better designs when it comes to science and stuff. Like, if you could see all the shirts I have, that's what it was. And this is from Amazon, so my clothes either come from the boys section or online. There's nothing in the stores. So, that's why it's science away. I'm just rambling. Um... But yeah, so I changed it. So now I have all these other logos on the inside, not logos, all these other icons inside my logo to basically give an idea of what I do. So for example, so let's see, how did I do this again? So I want to do STEAM, basically. So this is science, this is technology, this is art right here, that's a drawing tablet. This is engineering and this is math because it's measurement shapes. You know, that's, that is in math. And then here I have coding because coding is also, a, it's also a big part of what I do. Well, it's going to be, I'm, I'm learning. And it, it can also be kind of, it can be art. And I decided, you know, oh, I need to include more things. So this is the science stuff. This is the engineering stuff, tech stuff, and 
See, I don't know how that corresponds to math. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. <laughs> that's animation. I'm pretty sure it's not math. This is supposed to be math. I don't see animation. I mean, yes, you have to count frames and everything, but that's not really math. So I may change that. That's a whole other thing. I might just leave it. We'll see, but we need to, well, we, I need to change this. I mean, you can all tell me how it looks and everything. And I also wanted to do something different. For example, the, where is it? The back of the card is nice. And for those who are saying, there is no email here. There is, I just made sure to not show it on stream because I don't want people going back and watching the stream and spamming my mom. She's my momager, mom manager. And everyone has to contact me for stuff through her email. So I'm not showing on a stream. So we're not gonna miss him with this bottom row here. We're not, I'm just gonna leave it alone. But I might change like the links. And the other thing is, I can't have it too far out. My dad works at a printer and he knows what will work and will not work when it comes to printing. And he's been doing this for like 15 years, 16 years. He's been doing printing for a long time, almost longer than I've been alive. So the thing is when the machine has to cut, uh, how do I explain this? I just, I've been explaining one thing, but I was like, I just explained this other thing too. So basically it's a whole sheet of cards and then you, it goes through a sheet and it cuts them all. Well, if my design elements are too far out on the sides here, it can also get cut with when it gets, when the machine cuts it. So I have to make sure that doesn't happen. So he said, move everything in a little. Of course, if he has to, he can edit my design, but yeah, so I can't move anything out at all. I think I have my guide set up to make sure I wouldn't do that, but yes. So the back is fine. I feel like the front is bland and boring. Now, I'm a little biased because I like things to be complex and interesting. Nothing's wrong with simple. I just don't prefer simple over complex things. I like things to be very extravagant and, but not extravagant, complex, intricate, like this. Yes, this doesn't seem too intricate, but for example, see on the inside right here, these uh, lines, This that's the part that will only show up on YouTube when you're on the desktop or computer. So in that case, it seems kind of complicated. And notice how these guides are also set a certain way. So I have these guides set up to basically, so this whole rectangular right here will show up on the browser. Everything outside will show up on TV, supposedly. And inside this guide right here, this will show up on mobile. And I did this based on the YouTube template, which you can go download on the forums of YouTube. And we're gonna hit save real quick. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna be changing this. And I do have an idea because like I said, I feel like the front is lacking. It just seems kind of plain. Of course, that's just me. There is such a thing as over complicating things. I can make things look way too busy and no one's gonna, no one's gonna look at it because it's gonna be too busy. So I'm just checking my stream real quick, making sure everything looks okay. I feel like I'm I am. I'm streaming. My output stream is to the wrong size. Rip. Well, I can't change it now because I'm streaming, but I'll make sure to change it after because there's like black bars on the side. I am setting this up on a, oh, they're all different. The only one that fits is YouTube. Of course it's YouTube. Well, I guess there won't be a perfect one. Oh, well. Anywho. So, I was like, oh, I got three viewers. Nope, that's all me. <laughs> I can close my own stream. I know the chat works now. I don't need to have them open. And it's like, you got zero views, yep. Anyway. All right, so one thing I want to try is, you see how my logo has this nice galaxy pattern? Well, right here, this is actually the logo if I remember how to turn it on. Um, And that's something I can do later. Okay, this is the logo. And like I said, I might change that from animation to something else. I'd have to see. But 
basically, if you see how I have this nice background, <sighs> sorry, it's like a little tickle. Um, I want to see if I could do a galaxy for each individual icon on the back, the back's fine, on the front. And like it was leaking out of their hexagons. Did it make it seem a little jazzier, you know? Problem. That could be too much, but I definitely, I'm definitely willing to try it. I can't move anything up or to the sides. Everything has to be this close. I mean, I almost put just author, but I feel like I can't. Of course, I can move it YouTuber and instructor up, but then that's kind of crowding this. But I mean, there's this big gaping hole in the center and it's, it's so empty. But I mean, I don't know what else to put there. Now, one thing I will do is once I do that, do that, did I lock everything? I did not, good. This is a logo, let's, I did not configure GIMP before this. Oh, let's also show my guides, because I need those. All right. I feel like that's not gonna. See, I could do that. And that might, that, that could work. Control shift T, good to know. And that might not be too bad. It still seems a little crowded. Not crowded, but I don't know. It just looks a little empty. Not empty, plain, looks plain. I don't know, I would like to get a second opinion on this. I mean, my mom's in the phone, my brother's doing his own thing. So if anyone's in the chat is watching, what do you think about this? I think I may change this little icon from animation. I'm not sure if it really matters that much. I'm not sure what other, like, what do you do for math? I'm not adding a calculator, it's kind of mainstream to me. I don't know. Could just leave it. I mean, I honestly wouldn't know what to add, but yeah. What do you think? This is the back. I can't move anything outward or up or down. I can only move things inward. I want the text to be big so it would be nice and readable. Um, of course, it does bother me the text is not lined up, but oh well. Yeah, I don't know. It may be fine the way it is. But see, when I moved this down, this gap's kind of filled up, but now the tops look empty. And it looks like Erica Wagner isn't centered. I know it's centered. I have a guide straight down the middle, so I know it's centered. It just looks off based on how I've done it, but I, I don't know. Mm. I do want to try the galaxy idea. I'm going to put some music on. Hopefully you can't hear it. You shouldn't be able to hear it. Let's try. Looks like we're good. Let me know if you can hear the music. I'll um, turn it off. There we go. Hopefully I'm not too loud. All right, so.
Okay. And turn that off. All right, so we are going to edit this. I have to remember which one this is. I'm, I'm crashing. I, <laughs> I stayed up late and woke up early. So excuse me if I start yawning. Uh, let's see. Is the color tool not enabled? Hold it, where's the color tools? There's usually... See the tools I'm looking for, I'm not seeing them. In the latest version, did they get removed? Do I need to go install an old version of GIMP? Oh my goodness, please no. Uh, that I know of, Kawaii Chan. I mean, there might be lurkers on my stream, which is actually very common to have lurkers on my stream, but you're the only one chatting right now, but hi, how are you? Welcome. I was looking over there because my chat's over there. Sorry. Hi. Hello. Welcome. How are you doing, Quiet Chan? I'm looking for a certain tool. I'm not seeing it, so give me a second while I look through this. Oh, is it all in here? Let's see, I feel like I'd have that tool. It is here. Okay. Oof, okay. Oh, that's not the one I used, though. So it's in color. So now I don't have a tool over here anymore. That's interesting. So hue saturation, this is what I usually do. Oh, and I, I like how you're role playing as the actual character Quiet Chan from Off Mal. Off Mal. Aff Mal. <laughs> awesome. Did you have fun though? That sounds awesome, a water park. I haven't been to one yet. I mean like this summer, it just started, but I'm hoping to. How was it? You have fun? We're doing hue. See, I want to make 
No. This looks kind of weird. See, I want to make a red one. No. I want to try making red. That's awesome. I'm glad you had fun. I'm trying to make a red version of this galaxy based on a little thing I'm trying to do. I heard someone walking. <laughs> All right, this might be as red as it's gonna get. Let me reset. Let's try that. Right, there is no red, so it's not gonna do anything. Try blue. Ah, now we're we're gonna adjust the whole image. I think that's as that's as red as we can do. So let's try that. I need to export that. So the plan is, here's my business card. So we're working currently, we're working on a business card, my business card specifically. Uh, <laughs> and I said this looks like a little bland. That's just me personally. I thought it was a little, not bland, plain. And if I move this down, then up here looks really plain. So, and of course, I think I will move these up a little just because they're too low. So I'm gonna turn my guides on. It's a little hard to see everything with my guides on, but it works for me. Uh, oh, I don't have everything. Because <sighs> everything was lined up with that. Thanks, I'm glad you like it. Oh, let me show you the back. So this is the front of the car. This is, oh, wrong thing. This is the back of the card. This is filled in. I just have it turned off for stream. It's an email. <laughs> but yeah, this is the back of the card. I'm not going to change the back because it's already busy enough as it is. So I'm only doing the galaxy thing on the front. Otherwise, I feel like the back would just be way too busy. And I can't move anything outward or inward because after that point, uh, it's going to be harder to print it. So, okay. Red. Okay. So I'm going to save this. We're going to also export it. Yeah, I can kind of see that too. Like, it's like here. Like here's the nose, this is the mouth, the ears are here. That's what it is for me anyway. But yeah, that wasn't the attention when I created it, but I totally see it. All right, now, I feel like I should have more group layers just cause it's a little hard to see what I'm doing. Let's make this wider though. Okay, there we go. I probably don't need that letter, but I like keeping things even. But forget that. All right. So we're looking, okay. Also, if you're clicking, I'm just playing with this. I'll try to do something else. Because this is so much better. Oh, this image is not solid. Nice. Oh, that's cool. If you do do a live stream, good luck. Is this your, would that be your first time streaming? Uh, when you don't know what you're doing. <laughs> Hmm. 
Where's the size tool? The layout of this version of the game is different. I haven't gotten used to it yet. Is this it? No. Is it? It is. Okay, nice. Can I lock it? How do I lock it? Oh, this isn't, no. This isn't the size tool. This is the perspective tool. Reset. Uh, scale, here we go. It took me a second. It's all good though, okay. And I only need it to be slightly bigger. Oh, okay, cool. Scale. Did I ever set by accident? I totally hit reset by accident. Ah! Technical difficulties, I'm derping. All right, hit scale. See, that's what the problem was. I didn't do that correctly, okay. Aha, okay. Oh, I have a pro oh no, there's a problem with this. I colored in those hexagons. How could I do this to myself? Anyway, all right. Where is, I have to go get it again. Oh, I'm silly. Oh, yeah, I told myself, oh, you can just rotate it. It's no big deal. My past self. I'm like, why past self? Put it on one of the corners. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going to... Where is it? H hold on. I need to rotate this, first of all. What I'm going to do is I did it the wrong way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to replace this red background with a red galaxy and make it kind of like um, like a splat kind of thing. So I'm not done. I just have to edit this. And the thing is, I colored these things. I don't know why I decided, yes, this is a good idea. Why pass me? Why? Um, so I need to edit that. Uh... See, that doesn't look as clear to me, because it's not. See, rotating shouldn't have done anything to it. And I don't think I can... I hope it looks good at when I'm done. I hope it's worth it. Select that, delete. Will that be okay? No, no, it won't. Mm. I thought I had a clear rotated version of that. No, because the logo already has a galaxy background. I plan to do the color galaxy for each of the little hexagons. That's why I'm doing it the way I'm doing it. I wonder if it messed up because... No, 
No, that, that's still not clear. I can clearly, I can clearly see it's not clear. Um, do I have backups? Okay, let's try something. No, that's not. Yeah. I do appreciate your suggestions. I'm a little slow sometimes, so just give me a second. I'm trying to find, because it's not clear. I don't know if you can see it. I know I can, because that's what I am, but. Oh, I see. I got it. That's not clear because the pixels are messing up. It shouldn't be, but it is. So we have to do something else. First of all, duplicate, be gone. All right, so what we have to do instead which ones was I were using? That one, got it. We have to do this again. I did not catch that. Okay. There's the eraser, okay. I'm gonna clean this up. And Oh no, it's okay. Yeah, this is a uh, graphic design. Graphic design is when you take text, other images, props, and you combine them all to make a new image. For example, over here, I took this hexagon, I took a line, I took another line, more lines, another hexagon, and combined it to make this outline. I took one hexagon, made a bunch of them combined like this. That was quite a, a little bit of a pain to do. But I took these hexagons and aligned them a certain way. Then I put some color behind them and added the icons to make this nice little beehive of icons. <laughs> That's all graphic design is. So, wrong thing. So for example, do you see the hexagons here with the tech thing? Those are actually two separate things because that's what uh, graphic design, wrong thing. That's what graphic design is. So I took a piece of one asset and I'm adding it to this one and combining it so I can have a cool tech effect. I've been doing this for since 2015, I think. Oh yeah, it's, it's completely like Photoshop, except I'm not using Photoshop, I'm using GIMP. That's really the only difference. It's like Photoshop though. It's the free alternative to Photoshop, but it's called GIMP, G-I-M-P. And I really recommend it for anyone who's like trying to do graphic design or get into it. But yeah, 100% like Photoshop. <laughs> All right, so those two are there. I have to combine them now. Oh, I don't have a duplicate. Oh, well. Then we're gonna merge these two down by one. So now they're, no, they're not. What did I do wrong? Oh, they are, okay, I'm burping. All right, so now they're both one thing. So now what we're gonna do is we're gonna recolor this. We're gonna go to colors, go to hue saturation. Wrong thing. Nope, wrong thing. It's gray and it shouldn't be gray. Well, let's try this hue saturation and do it again. It's a very slow process to make white, but we're getting there. Usually when I do this, it works just fine. 
No, all right, you know what? That's not working. Can you do anime? Do you mean drawing? Because anime is a form of drawing, so do you mean can you, you draw in GIMP? How do I make this white? Yeah, you can draw in GIMP. I recommend something else for doing that, but technically you can draw in GIMP. Yeah, even the latest version has more support for drawing in GIMP now. Yeah, there's a tons of free programs out there though. Like personally, I recommend Krita. K-R-I, K-R-I-T-A for drawing, because it's, it's meant for drawing. Like for example, GIMP isn't meant for drawing. You can draw, for example, where is, take this. And see, I have all these different brushes and everything. And this is the latest version of GIMP. So you totally can draw in here. Like I just said, I just recommend something else. But it's just me personally, that's just my opinion, you know. Some people, you know, recommend something else, but you know. No, it's completely fine. You're fine. I enjoyed talking to you. Thank you so much for coming and have fun whatever you're doing. And thank you so much for coming to the stream. Really appreciate it. It was nice talking to you. Now, where's the thing I'm looking for? <laughs> uh, is it this? No. Almost. Is that? See, that doesn't look wide enough to me. Uh, hue saturation reset. No, that's not working. Okay. This is possibly not undoable. All right, we're gonna delete this and try again. That's not what I meant. Merge down. All right, let's ah. Uh, let us try lightness. It still looks like a tint of gray. It could just be me. Is it actually white? No. I guess they're the same. Uh, I'm not 100% sure, but we're gonna go with it that it's the same. All right. Now, white D hexagon, what is the size of that? No, turn on. Mystics were made. Anyway, what is the size? A hundred. Really? I'm also going to duplicate this so I have an extra. I guess it is a hundred. One hundred. No. One hundred. Scale, and we're going to turn the YouTube one off, and we're going to move this one here. All right, now we're getting a little closer to what I, blah, 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 blah. now we're getting a little closer to what I'm trying to do. Background. See, it probably doesn't need to be this big. Now, the only thing is when I'm printing, not I'm, when my dad is printing this, I don't know if that's gonna be too few details, if it's gonna be hard to print because it's like small details. I'm not sure, we're gonna try it. I'm also changing this music. Much better. 
Okay. And we're gonna work zoomed in. It looks horrible zoomed in, but it'll be better when I'm done. I just need to be able to see what I'm doing precisely. And we're actually gonna use MS Paint mode and I need an eraser, I need like a creative eraser. Can I erase with this brush? No, that is nothing. See, it's, it also might be too small to where this won't do anything. I don't know, we're just gonna try it. DNA, can I? No, see, that's not really what I'm, what I'm trying to achieve. Clouds. No, that's not really working. Oh, eh, it kind of was. Mm. No, it's not working. Because, you know, I can just erase it, obviously, but I want to be fancier. <laughs> I mean, this is me. I obviously want to be fancier because of how I am. Can I? See, I want to make it look like it's a paint splat. I probably should have done that differently, but. Oh, that could be cool. A race with this brush. Is that, will that work? That could, that could be cool, I'll admit. I don't think it's gonna have the effect I was going for. I'm gonna keep going though. I, I can undo if I need to. And this is obviously a rough idea of what I'm trying to do. Nothing's final yet until I say, okay, we're done, it's final. I can do something else, no. Could that be cool though? All right, let's zoom out. Does that work? If it was done differently, it could work. As, as is does not work. Personally, it does not. Uh, oh, you know what I didn't do because I'm derpy? I need to create a backup of this background. And of course, once I figure out how to get this background, I'll know how to do the other ones. So, I need to realign it. And my fear is it doesn't look red enough. And if we go over here, it's really not that red. So we can just try it again, just to see if we can get something redder. No. No, that was as red as I was going to get. Can I control Y? No, I've literally just got rid of the background I just created. 
Crip. Um, How do I do this? Wrong thing. And just a reminder, this is all because I want to be fancy. <laughs> Am I fancy? I mean, I want to be different. <laughs> I want to add flair to my business card. See, when I erase it, that's a problem. And then go back in. Nope. What I need to do is to find a sh is to define a shape. But that lets me erase on the inside, right? Yeah, that's pretty much the opposite of what I'm trying to do. Can I invert it? Nope, that's still inside. It's still inside. That's no. Well, let's just do this and see if this works. Rip. I mean, it looks interesting up close, but I don't know how well it will do when it's actually printed. May have to ask my dad, like, hey, do you think this will work? Because I think it looks cool. It still doesn't add a flair, personally. Because, yeah, the background looks cool now. And I technically can use it for the back of the car. But... The whole point was to like splash it out somehow. Oh my.
didn't need to do that. I obviously have the wrong tool selected. You know what? I, you know what would help this process? If I knew what I was doing. <laughs> And the problem with doing it just like I just did, it's not crisp enough. You can clearly, it, 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 it looks like I just took an eraser to it, which is bad quality to me. Uh. I don't know, maybe my business card is fine the way it is. But then there's a part of me that's like, no, keep going, you're doing great. It looks so much better if you do it this way. Sure, brain, sure. I'm pretty sure you meant to say whisper, not whissers, whatever that is. And no, you don't see me, okay. This is my brother, by the way. Don't mind him. He's a goober. And we're also just sassing each other. If he's here, we're just going to sass each other. And it's great. I'm actually serious this. Don't spam. My bot will kick you. <laughs> don't spam. Read the rules. It says use common sense. That's not common sense. Delete your own message, please. I'm serious. Delete, delete the, the long winded one, please. My bot will actually ban you. Anyway, I don't have the bot on. <sighs> Still, please remove that message. No, you're actually not the exception. Hate to break it to you, sweetie, but you're not the exception. Why is... I don't understand anymore. Okay, click on your message. Frequent... Have frequent mix for more so you know how to delete your own messages. Don't come in here and spam my chat and you don't know how to remove your own spam, okay? Don't spam me when you can't figure out how to remove your spam. Thank you. You didn't remove it. Did you? I don't know. I'm serious. Do not, do not spam. I don't care if you are family. Do not spam. You're spamming caps and you're spamming letters. Please stop. People are gonna go back and watch the stream and think, oh my gosh, what a troll. He's he's like <laughs> spamming letters and in caps and everything and wow, what a troll. I'll be like, oh, that's her brother. I did think we'd sass each other, but I mean, this is a little excessive. Cough, cough, get the hint. Question, what? What is your question? What does your question speak? Come on. What is your question? I don't know if it needs to be down there. Oh well. What is your question? And speak like a normal person. Someone's gonna come in here and be like, uh, can you please delete the spammer? He's disrupting my viewing. My uh, viewing experience. Well, write your question faster. What on earth are you writing? Do you need help with something again? Please say no. Say no, please. How do I make, I said say no. I can see the screen again. I tried to find the game tab. All right. Google it. 
I'm not Google. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Did you come to my stream to ask me a question? Did you only come to my stream to ask me a question and help you? Cody. Cody, please. Tell me you didn't just come. Not entirely. No, that means yes, you only came here to ask me a question. You don't care about my stream. I have a means doing. No, you hushed your face with that. I thought I hit enter. What is wrong with me? So that means I didn't hit enter over here then. No, I'm such a derp. Well, I mean, I have you're you're putting words in my mouth. Uh huh. Right. All right. All right. So you're disrupting my stream. I don't appreciate it. What happened? Oh, I know what happened. Okay. I panicked. I was like. All right, so it's true. You're spamming letters again. Rule says use common sense. Come on now. Anyway, um, so when you go to OBS, go to game captures. Tell it to tell it to select a specific window. Select Car Mechanic Simulator. Then click on the tab Car Mechanic Simulator, and um, and then click back to OBS, and then see if that worked. That's literally what I did. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, am I going too fast for you? Let's start off. <laughs> Listen and pay attention. Go to OBS. Go to the game capture. Shush, shush, shush. Hello, Loyal Von Joni? I'm not sure if I'm saying that correctly. Sorry if I got your name wrong. Uh, welcome to the stream. How are you doing? Give me a second. I'm helping my brother here. I look over here to my chest over here. My brother. Okay, go to, <laughs> go to OBS. Go to your game capture. Um, tell it to select a specific window. Then select a car mechanic simulator. Then click on the tab. Click the game itself, car mechanic simulator. Then back to OBS and see if it works. Yeah, how are you doing though, Loyal Von? See, I don't know if it's Jody or Johnny. Can you tell me how to pronounce that last part or what you want me to call you by? It would help me a lot. And did you get that, Cody? Cody's car comes with my brother. Don't mind him. Um. See, I can't tell. Joni. See, now I'm like, is it... What did you just say? Was that Joan or not? Jo was it Joan or Joanne? Jo Joanne, I don't know. Joni, I guess. I'm sorry. I'm really bad at names. I I sincerely apologize. Um. Welcome to the stream, though. And also, Cody, did you get that? Did you get that, Cody? Are you good now? A word fail can't. No, we really don't need to do that. Like John Snow with a die. Oh, Johnny. <laughs> Johnny. Is it Johnny? I'm so sorry. Like, I am trying. Oh, goodness. Okay. Um, do you support that? How are you doing, though? Aside from me getting your name wrong. Yanni? Oh. Yanni? How are you doing, though? Aside from me getting your name wrong, how are you doing? Welcome. Also, can I, do I need to come in your room? Are you serious? Do I need to come help you? 
Like, bro, come on now. No, no. Uh, did you get it? Figure it out. Okay, good. <laughs> Be gone from my stream. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. You can stay, Cody. I miss a specific text. Oh my gosh, did you? I'm glad you're doing great, though, Johnny. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I mean, you posted Yanni, I'm like, Yanni. <sighs> For now, I'm just gonna say Johnny. I. Okay, my present's good now. No problems with that anymore. Yay. Oh, goodness. Okay, we're gonna move this here. Or just call me, yeah, I'll just call you loyal. That's so much easier for me. <laughs> loyal. I can just say, hey, loyal Vaughn, or just loyal. <laughs> yeah, for now, I'll just say loyal. One day I'll probably get your name right. It's so much easier for me. <laughs> uh, sorry about that. Oh, I, mean, I tried. I did try. <laughs> uh, oh, goodness. Okay. <laughs> right. <laughs> I crack myself up sometimes. Right. So what other color was I doing? I need blue. I already have blue. I need green. Now, is this, does this have enough difference between it? This red, this yellow. I guess. No, you know, I'm changing. Export. Replace. Uh, okay. Hopefully that's good. Export. Okay. I also need to just delete what I just did. <laughs> so much for that. I do have a need to see what the size is. Why would I do that? Okay. Uh, since you did just join, let me explain what I'm doing. So I I am making, if we're not making, I am updating my business card. I already made half of it already off camera last month. So I'm updating my business card and let me take that off. So this is the front of my business card. And personally for me, it's a little plain. I've tried moving this logo, my actual logo down, but then the top right and top left become bare to me. But right now it's kind of bare in the center. So I'm trying to jazz it up a little bit. The idea I had worked so much better in my head. I did try something, it's not looking great, but um, I'm keep trying because if it adds flair and looks nice, I'm probably gonna keep it. But um, and I don't know what to add. Obviously I can move up instructor and YouTuber up a little bit, but actually is that not centered? I'm looking at this, it's not centered. How could this happen? It is? Oh, is YouTuber not centered? It is. Is instructor not centered? Something isn't centered and I don't know what, oh, it's this. That's what it was, okay. Oh, ah, <laughs> everything's messing up. But yeah, so I'm updating my business card. Oh, wrong way. I'm seriously questioning what's going on. Let's just undo. <laughs> but yeah, I'm updating my business card because my old one was outdated. And good. Move it pixel by pixel here. Okay, is that better? Kind of, anyway. So, that's the front card. This is the back of the card. 
Uh, I'm not changing anything on the back as far as I know. I'm just gonna leave it the way it is. Welcome back, Cody. But yeah, this is the back of the car with all the links. There is an email here. I just turned it off for the stream so no one's like, oh, an email, I wanna go spam. No, so I turned the email off. It is there though, trust me. <laughs> I'm trying to work on the front, cause like I said, the back is fine. I can't add anything more to the back. The front just looks plain to me. It could actually be fine. The front may may be fine. What do you think? Is the front okay? I would like some. I would like multiple op opinions though, because I honestly don't know. Sometimes I'm too close to my work and I'm biased because I like things to be a little complex. But um, thank you so much, Loyal, for following me. Welcome. It says you are a creative research voyager. I might change that name later, but for now, you're a creative research voyager. Welcome. Thank you. But, um, yeah, let me turn the guides off so you can see it better. Well, everyone on the stream can see it better. So this is the actual card. And personally, I thought it was a little plain, but if I add anything, would it be too complex and complicated and busy to where you don't want to look at it? Or should I try what I'm doing? Well, there's no point if I do that, Cody. I don't, cause see, originally the whole card was gonna be Galaxy, but since I changed my logo to be Galaxy, I decided I can't do that. So, oh, you know what? I am, I'm silly. That's what I am because there's something I can do which may work. It may add some jazz. Yeah, you can just make it nearly black. Well, there's no point. There's no point in doing that, Cody. Well, then I should do the same thing to the back of the card. And, you know, actually the back of the card could be galaxy, but I don't see a point in doing that. Um, I'll try it in a second, okay? I'll try it in a second. You just wait. You wait, Cody. Um, I'm gonna try my idea. I definitely do think YouTube and stuff should be moved up. Yeah, it should be moved up. Ugh. Uh, and who knows, maybe moving it up will solve my problem. I don't really think it will, but we can try. Why have you done this? See, now I won't know if it's level. Yes, it is a conundrum. Ha ha. Do not spam again. I swear if you start spamming again. Hush, child. Oh, I added a guy and I can't even see it. I should probably, I have so many guides. There we go. Okay.
Sorry I'm being quiet. I'm focusing. Um, okay, that's off center. Okay. I mean, it looks better, actually. I'm not questioning whether I need to add anything. I, you know what, fine. Cody will try your idea before I start adding a bunch of mess. All right, we shall try your idea. I don't know, maybe I'll like it, maybe I won't. Uh, no. This technically has to be above, not above, no. You'll like it. Yeah, I don't know about that. All right. It's not even the right size. Gosh. I blame you for everything. I just want you to know that. I forgot I have guides and I can't even see them. Oh no, I have to stretch the image. This could be okay, this could not be okay. All right, and then when you change the opacity, let's do like 50. No. No. Should I go more, 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 more? At this point, I question why I even have it. Why I even have it? All I see is like this little flame. It's not even, it's at 6.1 6 opacity. It, I mean, okay, I'll look, I'll admit. It gives the illusion it's popping off the card a little to me, but almost like, you know, you're viewing like this high pop color stuff. But I mean, is that the same one you use? Yes, it's the same one. I'm not gonna use a different color. That's my brand color now. Yes, it's the same one. I'm not using a red one. No, I'm not finding a different image because that's the brand color. That's why I just had the, the card black. Like you don't understand, I tried. I honestly tried. What if you just, no, I feel like that's even worse. No, it's not, the problem is not the image being stretched. It's the fact it looks bad. <laughs> then just like, so the color is, is the only thing visible. Eh, no. Oh, here, you know, I will prove it to you. Because you don't believe. Let the record show. I know what I'm doing. Why? I don't have the center? Wow, okay. And then we'll dim it. Like that. It's still not the. Eh. Eh. That's awesome. <laughs> Thanks, Loyal, but I'm not sure. 
I'm not sure if it would work. I honestly have to get my dad's opinion. He's the whole, he's going to be the one who's printing it anyway. So, and he's designed, like, he's been doing printing for as long as I've been alive. Well, actually, longer than I've been alive. So, almost like 15 years. 16, 17 years or so. So, and he's seen and he's designed a lot of business cards. So, I'll definitely ask him about this. It's not a bad idea. But I'm not totally sold on it either. Because it's so faint, I'm like, what's the point? At least 18, yeah, at least 18 years. You think the color should be more visible? Mmm, more visible. <laughs> Honestly, I would love to have it be this whole galaxy card. I want it to be like this one with like a super cool card. I'm dimming it back down. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm joking. Make the image bigger. Uh, sure. I have to go to Sleepy Hits. Three. Dude, what are you doing watching me? L loyal, go to bed. <laughs> Thank you for coming. I really appreciate it. I was also nice talking to you. Go to sleep. What are you doing? Watching streams at 3 a.m. I'm not judging, but dude. Go sleep. <laughs> You have a good night. Is that centered? That's it. It's finally good luck. 3, 3 a.m. What are you doing? Is this better? Sleep is oh, oh, okay. I totally understand that. Oh, I'm sorry you had a bad day at work. But hey, tomorrow, technically today for you, is a new day. So I hope things get better for you. I wish you all the best. Have a better day at work, all right? And just remember, you're awesome, all right? <laughs> Cody, why? Don't make my stream a meme stream, all right? Is this better? Since you clearly know more than me, why don't you come do it? I'm also kidding, you don't know more. Um, <laughs> I'm just saying based on our experience here, I'm not like dissing you. Just a bit, just a, just a wee bit more. Just a wee bit more. I'm gonna make it 10. All right, All right. no computer don't go to sleep. I have to chat over there. That's good. Uh, that's no different from what we've been doing. I hope you realize that. But now that but now make the image fit on all four sides. It does fit, just look at the outline. If I make it fit, there's gonna be more blackness than color. And there's only gonna be color in the center. Like, it's not a bad idea. I would add it to the back of the card. I would add it to the back, but the biggest bit of color needs to envelop the whole card. No, it really doesn't. It really doesn't. There needs to be some blackness. I'll admit, I do like the black edges. That's nice, but I, I don't know. Keep it down in it, she must be, no. Tell you what, I'm gonna duplicate this, duplicate. And we're gonna go all the way to the back card. I'm gonna turn this one off. See, I could see that working for the back of the card. I could see that. It, if you like the black edges, just make the image a bit bigger. No. <laughs> Reduce the black edges without eliminating them. I don't. I honestly don't think adding more color is gonna fix this. I think it, it does look good for the card. Honestly, if the galaxy is a no-go, personally, I still want to go with the idea of um, 
the front of the card is black and the back of the card is white. So for example, right now the back of the card is white text and images with a black background. I want to reverse it, do a white background with black text and black images. Just so you know, front's black, the back is white. It's like a cool little effect, personally. The left edge should serve as an outline rather than being slightly inland. All right, so we're leaving that for now. I do like the galaxy on the back. That is nice. And now back to the front of the card. You know, that could actually almost work. That actually really could almost work. For the lack of a better word, I use land. No, no, I get it. But see, I'm just gonna draw on the image real quick. No, just this whole thing, technically. The back of the card looks good. The front of the card actually could work. And I just wanna draw real quick. Let's get a color, like red. I right, slow. Oh, no, that's fine. Like. The back, the black is here. I'm, I can't draw straight. It's fine though. Like this is the black edges and I really don't mind that. Let me do better real quick. See? Push it to the R in nerd. I don't understand what you just said. And the reason I said like this could work, because it's almost like you're viewing in on something. I, I, I admit, it is a cool effect, because it makes everything else in the card look brighter, just because the back of it is... Um... See, the back of it is dim, so it makes everything in the front stand out more. That one should extend to the R, but no further. Oh, oh, I see. I see, I see, I see, I, I, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. No, um, no, 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 I'll try it, I'll try it, I'll try it, I'll try it. See, the problem is I can't see. So I have to hope for the best. Like that. No one can. It's, it would add a bit more color, but what if you get rid of the black? No one can. It's raining. The rain isn't gone. What are you talking about? Dude, come on now. All right, so let's see. This. So it's either this big or, or it's that. See, there's less black outline, but I'm not sure if I like that. I can see clearly now that you hushed. I feel like the color might be too much now. Don't know how you missed it. It's up to, um, I don't know because, see it's either that with like the hint of color, maybe just a smidge, but eh. Or it's like this. I kind of agree with you. The smaller one's better. It's, yeah, it is a bit much. Because the black outline is there, but it's also so much. So I do kind of like it better like this. Now, what I will do is... Okay, let's make this five. Just, just hush for a second. Hush, 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 hush. Go with me for a second. See, because 5 opacity and 5 opacity makes 10 opacity. That's my math logic here. Hopefully it works. Anyway, now what I'm going to do does that work at all? I basically what I did was I flipped it. Yeah, logic. Anyway, um, ain't, no involved, ain't no math involved in this. Eh. And I think they actually made it worse because now the color's kind of faded. That's technically better. But I think what I would do is I would actually flip it. Yeah, it looks like it was smudged. Now, 
Do you look at better flipped this way or flipped that way? Which I find a bit which way do you like it flipped? Okay, do you see the planet here? Planet up top or planet below? Or you know, dark down here and uh, explosion down here. I kind of do too because it's almost like it's bursting, like it exploded, you know? I do like that. Plus, you know, there's planets here now, so it's another thing of detail. Ah, I think it works like this. And then of course on the um on the back card, it's upside up. So it'll be different. And I think this actually could work. That would be impossible. Yeah, see, this is the thing. I don't know if it's too dark to where when dad prints it, it won't come out enough. That's That was my only problem with doing your idea. Is it's too faint, you know? I don't know how printers work, so I have no idea how that, this is going to turn out. But I kind of like it. It might need to be. Yeah, it might need to be. But the thing is. I feel like if it's just a smidge, just a smidge lighter, it might be too much. Let's go, let's increase it by five. Maybe, yeah, yeah, that's what I did. I made it 15. I added five. So let's do this. Darker, lighter. I'd almost like the darker. Like the lighter isn't too much, but I think the darker is just better. Lighter is better. Ah. Dark, light. Yeah, it might be dark when it comes out. True, true. Also, if that's the case, I'm gonna make the other one uh, brighter too. I do like the galaxy on the back though. Go 13, you think the darker one is better? We, we slash you need to find a good balance. Uh, I could see that, yeah. It's still pretty dark though. Let's be honest, it's still pretty dark. Uh, eh. I don't know. I think no. I think it might be fine at fifteen. It might actually be fine. Tell you what, let's leave it. It might be better at 15. We'll just leave it. I'll ask dad, uh, you know, see if this can work or not. We'll just have to see. I don't know. This may work. This may not. We'll see. Well, that is technically done. Now, I can either do the responsible thing and work on more science survey artwork and update more stuff, or do some fun stuff. What do you say? Responsible thing, work on this, or, you know, do fun stuff. Fun stuff like doing 3D art. <laughs> uh, Minecraft. 
I don't know. We could stream Minecraft. Do you want to stream? Do you want to like join voice call? I mean, I still want to stream. I just, I'm done with a business card. I'm still going to be streaming. I'm streaming until dinner, basically. Yeah, I guess we could do some Minecraft. That's going to be so bad. I have to get all my IPs. Oh gosh, no. Um, yeah, that'd be interesting. So you want to do Minecraft. Um, okay, so this is technically done. Forget responsible thing, I'm going to go play. Wow. See, I was like, hmm, my first stream can't be Minecraft. It has to be a science game. My first game stream, I mean. And what are we about to do? Minecraft. <laughs> uh, it's fine, though. Do you have your servers, or do I need to... Um, did I already uninstall Minecraft? <gasps> did I? Mm. Now hold on a minute. Did I uninstall Minecraft? I want pancakes. You're not getting pancakes. Oh goodness. Oh my goodness. I can't believe I did that. Oh no, it's my other computer. Ah. I want meal food, not snack food. I have to start up my other computer because I already uninstalled Minecraft. I already uninstalled Minecraft on this computer. Ah. No, 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 no. My IPs are on the other computer. It's it's actually fine. Um. Yeah, that looks pretty good. I know. <laughs> I mean, technically, I am, I have to stop the stream and restart it anyway since we're going to be streaming Minecraft. But do not spam. How many times did I tell you do not spam my chat? Cody, why? <laughs> Phil sticks. Um tell you what so this part of the stream is already over i've only been streaming for an almost two hours here okay the stream will continue on i just need to to <laughs> you didn't spell to jerkin right <laughs> thank you to jerkin anyway um stream will end here thank you all for joining the stream will continue on in a couple of minutes i'm gonna be streaming with my brother we're getting on voice chat right we're doing voice chat, right? Are we? But we're gonna be playing together. We haven't streamed. Thanks for having me. I didn't invite you, but yeah. No. Stop spam. Reduce your cap usage, okay? Chill. Chill. All right. Yeah. So we're we're gonna be streaming together. Wait, are you gonna are you gonna stream or are you are you gonna join me? Are, are you streaming too, or are you just going to join me? Yeah, okay, so we are doing voice chat. Join you. Okay, so he's not streaming. Ah, oh, cool. Nice, 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 nice. All right. So the stream will continue on in a few minutes. I don't have things up the way I want to do that right now. Yeah, fair. Um, yeah, so thank you all for joining. This was my business card. Uh, I'll be using it at events and stuff. Uh, I'll, I'll post, I will post the final product on Twitter when I have the final product. So follow me on Twitter. It is Science Her Way. Everything Science Her Way, basically. Um, and if you are just joining now, stick around because I'm going to be joining my brother in Minecraft. I know that game. We're gonna be doing some Minecraft together since we haven't done it in so long. But yeah, stick around for that. And if you are just joining now, not just not just stick around, but also 
if you want to see what I was doing earlier with this, this stream will not only be on in my VODs, it will also be on YouTube, which is youtube.com slash science her way. So yes, so yeah, we will see you all in a couple of minutes. All right, and we'll see you all in Minecraft. Bye.